It'll be okay. Good morning, Kevin. Good morning. All right, Goliath, the X700. We just got the new carbon graphite blades for it. I've been waiting for a little while. They were on back order. These are the 10 by 4.5s. So let me go ahead and uh, stretch the arms out. You like how that one uh, opens up, huh, Kevin? <laughs> I know you like that. <laughs> All right, let's make sure everything is on off here. Let's connect it. I still don't know the actual final battery time on this yet. Okay, we're on safe. And let me find the stabilize. I forgot which one it was. Hmm, they got the right one on. There it is. All right, self level is on. All right, I got my timer here for eight minutes, 30 seconds. I'm gonna turn that on and then we'll come backwards. You don't gotta go that far. Let's see how the new blades behave. All right, arms and ready to go. A little wobbly on some of them. We'll see. So far, pretty good on the takeoff. Kind of strong. A little wobbly there. Let's take it out to the street. Oh yeah, we got a little bit of a jiggle jiggle. You see that, Kevin? Where are you, Kevin? Get over here. All right. Should have that little jiggle jiggle there unless something is off. Where are you, Kevin? And I give him right next to me. There you go. He feels super light, but at the same time, he's a little, uh, a little wobbly there. I mean, I haven't balanced the blades or anything yet. Let me trim them out. And it's a simple, it's not an APM or nothing like that. It's just a simple, um, right, what was this one? The uh, K22 board from Hobby King. So it's a very basic board. Not a lot of uh, magic on there. No GPS, nothing crazy. Just a simple big beast. And I got to trim them out because he's all over the place. It's pretty smooth. Not too bad, right, Kevin? Let's see how fast he goes. Good brakes. <laughs> but he got that little wobble wobble. You see that? We got we gotta we gotta fine tune everything and see why he gets that little wobble at the end there. Get out of the street, please. The what? Maybe the battery on one side more than the other side. No, it's just just a little sensitive. See it? I, the, the slightest wind hits it and it, it gets a little bit of a, a bit of a wobble there. Yeah, a bit of a wobble wobble. Where are you? Stay next to me, please. Gotta keep, keep my eye on you here. It's not too bad. See, I'm not touching the control right there. He's gonna cut the tree. No! Oh, car's coming. Hold on. Kevin, to my left. Kevin, stay to my left. I am. Not back there, next to me. Okay. I'm right next to you. <laughs> to my left, please. Now I can see you clearly. So far, he's been up well, about four minutes. I'm gonna run the battery down. Let me see what where we at on the battery. Eleven volts. At ten point seven, it's usually when it's uh, it's down. All right, there. I'm just letting them float. 
nothing special. Make sure no cars are coming. Yeah, right there I'm not touching the control, he's just on, pretty much just hovering by himself there. Come back! Come back! And he still needs a little bit, you see how he's pulling a little bit to the left? He slightly uh, needs some adjustments. I mean he needs a lot to go, a lot of, a lot of tweaking here, I haven't cut, I haven't put the cables down, all the cables are just hanging there. So he's not perfectly balanced. I just want to see if these blades ran a little cooler, a little better. So either he's pulling a little bit too much to the left or he's pulling too much to the right. He can't be happy. But again, simple KK2 board. Nothing special, no GPS. Uh, and I'm using the very standard basic stabilizer that this thing brings. Um, the board itself as a simple, a simple stabilize. Which is not too bad. I mean, it's actually pretty smooth. I mean, obviously, if I take it off stabilizer, I can go into like a stump mode or something crazy. So these these boards are great for flying around, having fun, stunts. I mean, I, I wouldn't recommend one for filming. For filming, you know, you want something with a GPS, either a NASA board or a, or APM. But if you just want to fly around, slap a GoPro in there, do some flips, do some stunts, you know, not worry about if you you crash it or, or drop it into the ocean. Keep it nice and cheap, you know, you get a good frame like this 700, that's foldable, super lightweight. Right now, uh, with everything on there, including the uh, 6600 6, milliamp battery, um, just a little bit over three pounds. So it's not bad. And right now I'm hovering at, yeah, between 55 to 65. So, I mean, it has a lot of power. I mean, I just touch it and it flies up pretty good. <laughs> oh, I think I it didn't like when I when I yacked it hard. <laughs> oh, really? Already? Oh man! Let me see where the battery's at. I might have like 10.8. Wow, went down fairly quick when I yacked it hard. You would think this battery will last longer. I mean, it's only a single 6600. I might just put two on there because it'll handle the weight definitely. So if I'm doing uh, seven, eight minutes with a 66, and either a dual 52 or a dual 66, should last pretty long. That's kind of cool. Yeah, he only beat because I. Uh, I cranked up the amps when I accelerated really fast. <laughs> Come on. Stay over here. Still going. Come on, you can go a little longer than that. I think it's almost there. Seven minutes, thirty seconds. That's it. Ready to go?